I, uh, I just learned a few minutes ago, it's the first time a Big Ten team has come in here to play a basketball game in 41 years. 41 hey. years. You love the history here. What does that mean to be a part of a game like that tomorrow? Maybe? Uh, you know, it means a lot, and I know it means a lot to the fans. So, uh, you know, we got to come out with our A game, you know, come out not sluggish, you know, play hard for, for 40 minutes, and we'll see the results. Obviously, the game you all played last season against them, how much maybe this week, early in this game, maybe kind of pop back to that and remember just, you know, the, the emotions of that and how much they kind of fire you up for the chance, you know, another chance at them. Uh, you know, I... I know I can't be the only one, but you know, when, whenever Wisconsin come up in our heads, you know, that's the first thing to come to mind, that play. But, um, you know, we forgot about it, and this is a new game, so we're going we gonna to do what we got to do. Charles. Charles. Oh, go ahead, Brad. Sorry. Yeah. I was say, Charles, you guys have played well against some of these Arkansas and West Virginia and things like that this year. Uh, how confident are you guys going into this game against Wisconsin? Uh, I know my team is confident enough. I mean, we just go in and play. Every every game, good game. Uh, you just we just gotta play good every time. It starts with the practice, going into the practice, giving all we get, and then go tomorrow and just do the same in the game every time. So that's what we do. We just give everything we get every time. Charles, how do you feel about the way you all played last time against St. Mary's? I feel good. You see, we 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 doing offense. We we return the ball. We play. We play a lot. We share the ball a lot. We play good defense, and we just gotta do that every game. I'm just gonna come out with a win. So we just gotta do that. We just gotta keep. Consistency going so. Tavion, do you think this Wisconsin team's a lot better than the one you saw a year ago? Uh, yeah, you know, they was tough last year, but I feel like as the team stay together, they get even tougher. So um, we know they're tough. We're gonna look into it. We're gonna study this film. Tavion, you obviously faced, or you're all team faced Ethan Half last year. You know how talented he is. You know, Charles also kind of risen to the occasion. He's facing these talented big men. Just, yeah, how excited are you to see that matchup tomorrow? How confident are you that Charles can, can play well against half? Uh, it'll be nice. I, I know it's a tough matchup for Charles. And, you know, I know he ain't, you know, he's a freshman. What is half? But junior? Senior? Ooh. Senior. Ooh, Charles. <laughs> uh, he's a senior, so uh, Charles got a big matchup. And we're we going to see what Charles can really do. Charles, how excited are you? Uh, yeah, it's it's gonna be a good game because I know my teammates got my back. You understand? So it's gonna be a good game. I'm just I'm just get, I'm just ready to just play. You understand? Just, I just going with just going there with my mindset, get ready and just just go and play with my teammates every time. So it's gonna be a good game. I mean, Happy's a good player, you know. So I just gotta get ready just to go against him. That's it. Charles, a bit of a personal question. Obviously, you know this is Penn alma mater, and you know. <laughs> The relationship you have with him, um, I, I'm not asking if there's mixed feelings, but you know what Wisconsin means to to NC, yeah. both professionally and personally, don't you? Yeah. Um, what What does it mean to get a chance to play against NC's alma mater? Uh, I mean, it's good. You understand? He was he was talking to me last night. He was like, "They're they're gonna come against us. They're gonna come out. They're gonna come out strong and stuff. We gotta get ready. You gotta talk to your teammates. We're watching film last night, so we're just telling me different kind of stuff. When it was at Wisconsin, the way they played, the way they come out, the way they um set their charges and stuff, faking them screens. So he just they just he was just telling me stuff. I just gotta get ready. Just get my mindset ready. Just knowing going to the game. Me as a big man, I won't get, I won't get no calls and stuff. Just going there and just play strong and just he was just he was just telling me the history of the school and stuff like that. Tavion, you know how much they like to their guards especially like to take charges, so that's something uh, you kinda keep in the back of your mind when you're playing offense tomorrow. Uh yeah, you know I've thought about that. But um you know, you gotta be ready for it. Uh if I watch film I'll I'll figure out what to do and what not to do. Tavion, I'm gonna ask you this. Charles, the same question is to you, but it's about Delano. I look at him and I'm like, this guy's he's coming on. Yeah. And he's got that perspective playing point guard, passing mm -hmm. angles because of his height. Do you see that coming on with him? And you know, as a guy who's getting passes from him on the perimeter, how good could he be? Uh, since the Washington game, uh, you know, I feel like he kind of let that get in his head. 
So, you know, the next few games after that, he just keeps getting tougher and tougher, you know. He's showing more of a point guard. That's what he really is. And, um, you know, I feel like as the games keep going on, he's just going to keep getting better and better and better. And, you know, we need that. Charles, same thing. And I know that you guys have a pretty good passing rapport, that inside out. Do you feel like that's getting better the more you guys play? Yeah, I mean, if you see um, Dylan has been getting better and better during games and stuff. So, I mean, if you see the last couple of games we played, he has like six assists, seven assists. So that means he's, he's, been, he's been listening to coaches. He's been getting better. And just he just he should just continue doing that. We're going to get better as a team. So.